story mode. Arthur's house. Okay, so... I'm literally just gonna read this scene. This is like a whole cutscene and everything. I just wanted to test out a different microphone. I still... The AC's still blasting, so... Congratulations, you get that. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Good work. The bike's a complete wreck, but somehow we made it. The doctor's scheme is moving along as planned. We need to hurry and do something about it. Okay. I'm gonna hold down the Z key to move faster. Welcome back! Seems I owe you yet another one. With Kazuma here, I'm sure we'll be able to handle the password for that egg. Professor Booster, can we bring him along? Professor? Sue, our escape must be put on hold for now. The doctor has found the location of the red flowers. Huh? As of yet, he doesn't have his hands on them. But it's only a matter of time before he does. Their location is in the sand zone. I've heard that the red flowers are there. Sand zone? I don't remember the voice. So if we go there, will we find the doctor? Ahem. I fear that it is the doctor's minions that will presumably go. We must eradicate the red flowers before they get to their hands on them. However, Sand Zone is a very dangerous place. If we were to go, whether or not we can make it back alive isn't... Are you giving up then? Actually, no. We have just the right person here with us now. You. What is he? Well, he's an armed recon robot that was dispatched to this island ten years ago. A robot? I had heard that they were all destroyed after the war. However, I don't know the exact details. Perhaps one of them... Professor, I've connected us to the Sand Zone tel teleporter. Hmm. <laughs> you are the most ideal among us here to search the island. Please help us. Sand zone, huh? Boing, 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 boing. If there are no more red flowers, we can hopefully avoid the war. Well, that's a pretty heavy responsibility, don't you think? You're the one from ten years ago, aren't you? I didn't realize it at all until just now. You're indeed well made. Connected to Sand Zone. It's a teleporter. Sand Zone. Alright. Should I just not save the game? I'm worried. I'm worried something's gonna go wrong here. I don't- I'm not sure what. Hmm? Yo! Like, something's gonna go wrong, right? 
Ah. Hey. Look, a visitor after such a long time. I know what you want to do. But you better wake up. The Amiga aren't the enemy. They're totally harmless. I feel sorry for you. I'm on the Mimiga side, and I'm not gonna lose to you. I died. You won! You got me. You've been defeated. Do you plan on disposing of the Mimiga? No. Oh! <laughs> Are you on the Mimiga side too? I know, it's not their fault. I'm Curly Brace. I've been with these little ones since before I can remember. I don't recall anything before that. Apparently, it's so-called memory loss. I may have been a Mimiga... I may have been a Mimiga killer just like the other recon robots. Oh! Your Polar Star, it's thrashed pretty badly. Wanna trade it for my machine gun? Nope. Oh yeah? You can come back anytime if you end up changing your mind. Or something. These fucking text prompts are keep going! Too slowly. It's deceptive. I should I just slow down my cadence in general? I don't. Yeah. I want to eat some tasty fish. Yeah. You must remove the curse to move the sunstones. Be careful with those sand crocs. They'll bite suddenly if you dare walk directly in the sand. And they'll take a big chunk out of ya. Are you looking for the red flowers? The old lady named Jenka might know something about them. Oh yeah, one thing. If you go to her house, you should take the dog next to the bed. Look in the next room. Yo, it's a fucking dog! I hate dogs. Arf! You wanna bring him along? Yeah. Picked up the dog. Okay. How much of this am I gonna play? Uh, I feel like something's gonna go wrong. I'm not sure what. Something may have already went wrong, because I, I saved. We'll see. This is not the way to old Lady Jenka's house. Oh, there's a boss we have to defeat with the dog on our back before then. Yep. Hajime, Jenka's pet dog and leader of the bunch. Lost while looking for his siblings. He likes Curly's place. A silver locket in the shape of a fish. From the wear on it, the locket must have been dear to someone for many years. One of the two keys to Arthur's house. It was found near Arthur's gravestone. An ID card found inside egg number six. A rusty key. It has the word gum. I didn't think of just not fighting these guys, but that's pretty easy to do. Well, that's quite the section. Those things present no threat whatsoever.
God, this music is great. I think the fireball kills this guy. Best. That Balrog, he's blundered yet another time. Hmm. You have a lot of spirit. However, to come all this way here, you're a bit troublesome. You want to take me on? Oh, it doesn't seem like it'll be necessary. Bye now. Okay, got him. Defeated Omega. The curse on the Sunstones is lifted. Ta-da! These things can be... a hassle. Let's take it slow. Jenka's house. My doggy! Gave her the dog. You returned him to me. It was very nice of you. What? The red flower. Oh yeah! <laughs> How you doing, Oni? Oh, it's you, Balrog. You look good. How's my stupid daughter been lately? Ha! Stupid daughter. You mean misery? She's also fine. A new master has appeared. This time the surface will finally be ours! Are you two still trying to do that? I'm not here to cause you any trouble. I just came by to pick up the key to the warehouse. You know, the warehouse with the flower seeds! Huh. I have no idea what you're talking about, Barbara. Is that so? You're just pretending that you don't know? I see now. You're gonna betray us then. Is that it? You'll be sorry! A new master. Must be another idiot at it yet again. About my dogs. I have four more still. My little pups. These legs of mine are so very weak. Sorry for the inconvenience, but would you mind finding the rest of my dogs for me? Still four left. Sorry for the inconvenience, yeah. Orf! You wanna save ya? Game saved. Bum, bum, ba bum, 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 ba 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 ba. Okay, while I like the tune, it gets hellish. It's, it becomes a, a pain point after a while. Sand Zone Warehouse, East.
Dog. Deserted house. Do you want to save? Yes, game saved. You have died. Yes. Bring him along? Yes. You die with me! No. Shinobu. Another of Jenka's lovable puppies. This poor little one suffers from bad vision, so he sticks to dark places. I don't need to fight every enemy. You're fast! This is certainly one of my beloved little dogs. Gave her the dog. By the way, you must be a soldier from the surface. It's been a long time since all those robots just like you came to this island. They were responsible for the deaths of so many defenseless Mimiga for the lives of the brave men and women who tried defending them, Amiga. To get the effects of consuming the forbidden flower, the cornered Amiga became utterly rabid. They fought back viciously against the robots that had invaded their island. Who knows? Had there been no red flower, it's very possible that the Amiga on this island might have been annihilated. Three more left. I know you can do it. Open the treasure chest. It's a dog. Picked up the dog. Mick. Jenka's pet and an adept treasure hunter who loves chests. He loves sleeping inside any chest he can find. <laughs> oh, definitely. That one's mine. Gave her the dog. Thank you so much. This one makes three. Have you ever seen an enraged Mimiga? Eating the red flower will make me stronger. A great many of the Mimiga believed this and chose to eat the red flower. Then, and only then, did they fight back against the battalions of robots. But, do you know what happens afterwards to an Amiga filled with such rage? It was so terrible. Perhaps they couldn't control themselves. Well, most of the Amiga who consumed the red flower were never to be seen again. They went missing. I heard a rumor that they were supposedly made it down to the surface. Where the humans live. The thought of the enraged Amiga anywhere close to the surface. With humans. If it's really true. 
you yet realize it? Do you realize how dangerous the red flower actually is? Two more pops. You wanna save? Game saved. Hajime. Shinobu. Mick. Okay. They've really taken a liking to you, child. Two more. Oh, this fucking guy. You want to bring him along? Yes. Picked up the dog. Kakeru. Best with a bone. Jenga's pet hides so many bones in so many places it's hard to keep track of them. Kakeru. Ah! You are the popular one. My dogs aren't very fond of troublemakers, either. I really do appreciate all your hard work so far. Gave her the dog. Is it the warehouse key that you're after? Same warehouse key that contains all the red flower seeds in it. it doesn't matter to me who you are, understand? I can't give you the key to the warehouse. Sorry. Opening the warehouse? That would be foolishly. Allowing an encore of the same tragedy from a four. One, two, three, and four. Only one more to go. One more. Why don't you give up on finding the red flower? I feel like I'm gonna regret leaving that guy alive. Oh, so soon? Why did I do that? <laughs> because it's... It's locked. Yeah, that's right. We gotta come all the way back. Uh, I might actually fi fall into a spike trap, so I'm gonna save my game here. Ah! Alright. I have the warehouse key! Alrighty then, see ya! Wait! Hmm. 
You want to save? Yeah. Game saved. Oh, it's you. Gave her the dog. The key. The key to the warehouse was stolen by Balrog. Please, stop them. They'll unleash rabid Mimika, possessed by the red flower against the surface. Wait. Please take this with you. Obtained a life pot. Holy shit! I can use this to heal! Use it and your life will be fully restored. But just once. That's great. <laughs> if I ever take two dam health worth of damage, I know I'll have this lifesaver on me. Please, please stop them. They'll unleash rabid Mimika, possessed by the red flower against the surface. Whoa. Good. I didn't read the last dog's description. Oh, baby! Nene, a beautiful dog belonging to Jenka. This one dreams the days away with long, long naps. Um... So wait, if I leave and head to the warehouse and I just take the dog with me, what will happen? If I just went with the dog to the warehouse, would something different happen? I guess not. Probably not, no. This boss battle sucks. This is the first, it's probably the first one that's gonna make me sweat. And uh, uh I wanna be in bed soon. Great doctor. All the red flower seeds have been harvested. Good. By the way, the flower's blooming there. Are they the demon flowers? Yes, sir. Well, well. Such an ominous flower. Unexpected, to say the least. My great doctor, would you like to eat one? No, that won't be necessary. Well, why don't we sample it by using a Mamika instead? Yes, I agree. Ugh. Huh? Here? Ah! Hey! Where are you going? Balrog, make her eat a red flower. Got it! Please don't! Eat it! Eat it! Stop now! Toriko, you alright? King? Uh, my head. No. You're that doctor. Indeed. I am the doctor. And your new leader. I should say it's a pleasure to finally meet you. Tell me, is there something you'd like to do with that sword of yours? <laughs> I'm going to kill you! Without the power of the red flower, they are weak. Oh, you're that persistent soldier from the surface. You have perfect timing. They're all yours, a small gift from me to you. <laughs> There's no need for you to thank me. Handle them, will you?
I remember this boss being harder for some reason. Uh, <laughs> I don't know how to feel about this. I remembered the boss battle being a lot harder. <laughs> Defeated Rabid Toroko. <sighs> I can't help you anymore. Will you avenge me? Obtain the blade. Oh yeah! Sorry! <laughs> You're still alive. There was one back then, too. A tough little robot like you. There'll be no end to this if we try to take you head on. I'm sending you to the labyrinth. And you, too. Eh? Huh? <laughs> that was refreshing. You've hit the ground floor. Where is this place? Labyrinth 1. You want to save? Yeah. Alright, I'm done for now. Hey gamers! I'm done! Suicide!